My dear brothers and sisters, in our gospel today, we have heard Jesus Christ saying, The Son of Man is Lord of the Sabbath. These words of Jesus would uh, define um, his understanding of the Sabbath, in which the Pharisees have misunderstood. They have different kind of understanding of the Sabbath. Although we know that so we will say Sabbath, Sabbath is cessation of the work. Is part stopped from the word. It's a rest. Although here we see that it was understood absolutely, strictly, and according to the Pharisees, that even to work for life, to work for the good of people, would go against in this violation of the law of Sabbath. But then Jesus said, "Have you not read?" That David did when he and those who were with him were hungry. It's all about life, starvation to death. When he said how he went into the house of God, took the bread of offering, which only the priests could lawfully eat, ate of it and shared it with companions. My dear brothers and sisters, we know that Jesus Christ is defining the meaning of work, in which work has to really work rest as you really rest in which we could see that according to the pharisees they have actually uh, gave the different meaning of work in which work must be a time to rec recreate work must be a time to unwind work must be a reflection of 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 man's creative action in line with the God's creative action. But here, my dear brothers and sisters, looks like work has changed its meaning. It is becoming an over uh, burdensome. It's becoming burdensome. But here, my dear brothers and sisters, we see that our Lord Jesus Christ again defining that let us not forget that work meant to uh, expression of our creative action work meant to recreate us to unwind us not to overburden us and this is the understanding of the Pharisees my dear brothers and sisters our Lord Jesus Christ then is inviting us that the Son of Man is Lord of the Sabbath in which Sabbath is only made for men not men is made for Sabbath. In which Jesus Christ is telling us that above and all, the most important is the human person. Above and all, the important is the human life. And that is our Lord Jesus Christ trying to tell the Pharisees. My dear brothers and sisters, in this time of pandemic, we know that there are a lot of opportunities we're in, not only a time of rest, while we are restricted with mobility, when we are, cannot move and do things what really wanted. But one thing has bring us to realize this pandemic time is that the meaning of work and that we have actually wonderfully and creatively made ourselves more productive. And that is reminding us, my dear brothers and sisters, work as we work and our work must be reflection of god's creative action and rest as we rest most especially the most important is that the human person and the human life the son of man is the lord of sabbath not that man is made for the sabbath the sabbath is made for men not man is made for sabbath Amen.